Hi Randy, um, so this is just a quick uh, workaround to overcome the problem of selecting multiple simple buildings inside uh, complex buildings. Not ideal, but I hope it will solve your problem. So until, at least until we add the feature that you suggested to Modeler. So what I'll do here is you can see I have two complex buildings and I can just select parts when I enter them. So to overcome this problem, what I'll do is I'll go to open data, urban control, open urban control data table. What this will do is it will bring me the, uh, this uh, data, tabulated data in modeler, right? So uh, in here, what I want to do is I want to make sure that my complex buildings are selected. So this gives me just the full numbers for the complex building. And then I also need to select complex building parts because now you can see that I can select different uh, simple buildings within different complex buildings. So let me do and select this one also. You can see when I click it, it becomes blue and it gets selected in inside uh, SketchUp. Something I cannot do basically just in SketchUp when I have grouped objects. So now you can see I can go here to model or user interface and change, for example, uh, height to seven stories. Both buildings have been adapted. I can change also the use. Let's go to parking, for example, and so on. So whenever I pick a part, it gets added or removed from the selection. And then I can, I can uh, modify the parameters the usual way as I would do it normally in Modeler. So I hope this workaround works until we add the feature you suggested to Modeler. Bye-bye.